I think it's a beautiful day for the bot botanical gardens. What do you think? Hello? You talking to me? Yes, I'm talking to you. I said I think it's a beautiful day for a walk at the botanical gardens. That was just fantastic. Was it I just lost? Your brainioski. My brainioski. I, I seem to lose my brainioski pretty often. That means you forget things in mid-sentence and you forget what you are doing five minutes ago. We're this close. Do you know what that close means? Here. Just ask me how excited I am. It's absolutely beautiful here. It's a beautiful day. Here in East me. You can hear the plane going over, but I um, hope you enjoy the pictures from this video and have fun with me. These bamboos always just fascinate me. Just fascinate me. They're absolutely huge. I'll include a picture of them. And every time I come here, I simply just almost want to live here. It's just so luscious. And this is a perfect late September day. It's just absolutely, absolutely just perfect. The smell here, I can't even describe the smell to you. Of course, it changes depending on what we walk by. But the smell is just incredible. Oh, such a treat. Such beautiful, gorgeous paths and grounds. And it, you know, you walk along through here, and me, at least, it's like a dream. It makes me think of the early days of HGTV. Sorry for the plain noise overhead. But they used to have. Um, the gardens oftentimes on the early uh, it's just like 20 something years ago and it just reminds me of that all the paths and the gardens and um, whatever anyhow but this is absolutely gorgeous and the prettiest little steps what do you think these steps lead up to just absolutely beautiful. Can I live here? I just want to live here. And no, I can't live here. But I want to. I want to live here. Oh, just reminds me of when I was a child and we used to, we used to walk in the woods. I'm not walk in the woods, I played in the woods. Wasn't afraid of things. Of course, I didn't live in Texas then either and we didn't have all these rattlesnakes and all this stuff but uh, hey I had a tree half a tree, tree branch on my head just walked up the steps we're still walking if a snake comes out you'll be the first to see it I guess yes there are signs all around warning about snakes just to keep an eye out on them uh, I am not a snake lover at all. I like nature trails, and this is not a nature trail, but I go out and I don't worry about the wild boars or the alligators or the snakes. Maybe I should. And yes, it is a rather warm day, but I have no complaints whatsoever. None at all. Just, oh my goodness, no complaints. It's, it's probably 90 degrees. Uh, 
but it's just absolutely yeah it's just perfection I mean I can I can smell the fall in the air but that is just the decomposing of um, some of the leaves that's probably about it and the decompose, decomposing of the leaves is not the typical northern leaves like the maples and all of that this is just the leaves that are um, on the ground just the natural falling of the leaves just look at this and I'm standing here it feels like it's 10 degrees cooler this is a beautiful southern magnolia in this ground cover just very very special So gorgeous. I don't know how many times I've said that today. I'm a little bit red, more than a little. Sadly, it's time to leave. I've had about enough sun for the day. I didn't wear sunscreen like I did two weeks ago at the, at the uh, beach. So I think I'm gonna pay for this, but sadly we're leaving. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Yep, and we have other gardens we're going to visit as well in the future, so I'm glad you tagged along. I think, I think I accidentally got you ladies in the very end of my, is that all right? Is that a real quick one? Yes. I didn't mean to.